Hello friends, I am Allison from Pragmatic Techsoft Private Limited India. Today let's explore our WooCommerce Odoo connector. So this is the dashboard of WooCommerce. As you know on left hand side you can see different configurations. So first go to WooCommerce in settings. In settings you can see all these options. Select API, under API you can see keys apps, under keys you can see all the history of the previous keys, and if you want to create new key, you have to just click on add key. Then you can give description here. Then click on generate API key. So here you can get two keys, one is consumer key and another is consumer secret key. Now go to Odoo platform. As you can see this is Odoo 11 Community Edition. Go to Settings, select Companies, click on My Company and here you can see the module we have developed WooCommerce Connector. Under WooCommerce Connector you can see Consumer Key and Consumer Secret Key. Now you have to just copy these keys respectively into Consumer Key and Consumer Secret Key and then just click on Save. Then click on Authenticate, you can see the message as Test to Success. In our module we can sync product categories, sync different types of products, sync inventory, sync customers and sync sale order. On right hand side you can see the last sync date and time, and also the last imported ads. So you can import data from WooCommerce into Odoo by just clicking on respective fields. Now let's start from importing customers. So go to WooCommerce, go to users, click on add new. For example test users, you have give test email address, and just click on add new user. Now you can see new user is created in the WooCommerce. Go to Odoo customers, so the test customer should reflect here after the syncing. So let's sync customers, go to companies, my company, WooCommerce connector, and click on sync customer. Now let's see, after clicking on customers you can see testing customer is reflecting in customers dashboard. Similarly for the products, let's set a product name test 1, regular price as 1500 and sale price as 1000. Ok. So let's publish this product. Go to products, so test 1 products should reflect on this window. Go to companies, my company, sync product. OK. So this is the test one product. So sale price as 1500 and WooCommerce sale price as 1000. OK. In order to you can also give cost price i.e. cost to the company. So product data is reflected in order to. Similarly for orders, you can create new orders in WooCommerce. And after clicking on Sync Sale Order button, you can see all your sale orders reflected in the Odoo. So this is our WooCommerce module. Thank you so much for your time. Bye.